Should have not done that. Ow. I'm back from gym and I'm sipping on my CBD tea with some chamomile because I'm tired and my muscles are extremely sore so I definitely need this right now. A lot of people actually do ask me all the time how do I use CBD when it comes to working out specifically because yeah, there's a lot of ways you can really use CBD. There's not really a one specific way you can really use it. Um, it can go anywhere from sleeping aid, anxiety, inflammation, all the way to just overall performance actually. So I'm gonna here tell you how CBD can benefit your workout and how you could potentially add it into your routine so you can just have a better, safer, and overall recovery. I know I explained this multiple times, but most people still do not know what CBD is. And CBD, it is basically just one of the components that comes from the good plant. We all know what the good plant is, Mary Jane. Even though this comes from marijuana, it is not a psychoactive, so it's not gonna really give you a high feeling, but it's definitely gonna give you all the benefits that marijuana still has without all the extra stuff that is illegal. Well, in most states, I guess, because, you know, times are changing. Just because you take in CBD, it doesn't mean that all your soreness and all your anxiety, all your problems are gonna go away. Each person has a different experience when it comes to CBD. That's why it's really important for you to try it out, depending on what you're looking for, and see if this is something that can actually benefit you. For fitness, CBD, the main thing that it does is just to help you recover a lot faster. It helps with the inflammation of the muscles, because when you're working out, you're technically tearing up your muscles. So those little tears need to recover, therefore they can grow bigger over time, therefore you got gains. So having a good recovery is not only good when it comes to avoiding injuries, but it's also really important when it comes to see a huge improvement in your own physics or overall performance. Um, CBD is also known to like reduce inflammation in the joints. So if it's something that you have an issue with, like you have a lot of knee pain, or just working out can be a little bit painful for you to potentially add CBD before or after your workouts so this inflammation in your joints is not so severe. Um, something that I also like to add along with CBD for inflammation in my joints, especially for my knee problems, is turmeric. I will 100% recommend to try CBD and turmeric for knee pain because this is something that I actually have been constantly using for the past couple of months and I have seen a huge improvement on my knee pain because of that. Of course, CBD, it is known as a sleeping aid too because it will make you feel a little bit drowsy, almost relax, almost like melatonin. It will also significantly help out your muscle recovery and also your performance. CBD is known for helping your body to stay in a REM stage for longer, meaning you're gonna be in a deep sleep stage for like a long period of time. During this sleep, the brain and the body temperature and heart rate falls, and the brain's not working so much, it's not really doing all its thing, so your body can just recover 100%. The more time you spend on the deep sleep stage, the more you're gonna feel relaxed, and the more you're gonna feel like you slept. <laughs> uh, one of the last known things for CBD that I actually just recently find out, I didn't even know it could be used for, but you can also use CBD when it comes to performance, because if you like to, you can actually take this as a pre-workout and I know most people that think pre-workout as you need to be like hype, you need to like get going, you need to be like ready to fight anyone that gets in your way. I myself for example, I do can have some anxiety before going to the gym especially because I have social anxiety so if I happen to go in a time in which I know there's gonna be a lot more people than usual a lot of times my brain is not really gonna be focusing on my workouts, it's gonna be focusing essentially on the people all around me, it's gonna cause my social anxiety get even worse. So taking a little bit of CBD before your workouts, it can actually help you out with your performance. It can also use reduce inflammation while you're working out as well. So like I just mentioned, if you do have knee problems, they can significantly reduce the pain. And of course, it will also reduce overall stress, which can mean your body can recover a lot faster as well. So yeah, even though I don't take my CBD before workout, I do take this mainly after my workout, especially before going to sleep. And the most common way I do it is by taking my gummies, which I do not have right now because I've been eating them way too much, or just using some unflavored CBD oil inside of my tea, in which I just pour three to five droppers and just mix it in, 
and just drink it like usual because it really it really tastes like nothing like i don't even know i have cbd on my tea sometimes you can go to sugarandcrush.com and check out all the cbd products because that's the products that i've been using for like over a year now and i personally like all their stuff that are 100 cbd so you don't have to worry about some sneaky thc being along the way because trust me i've been through the herbal with this thing and it's definitely cbd 100 cbd they are great to be honest or sugar free so you don't have to worry about extra calories or anything like that and not just that but they also offer oils gummies skincare and more check them out and if there's anything you might want to buy then use my code sarah pay 20 so you can save 20 percent off at the checkout thank you guys thank you for watching this video hope you like this and i also, also hope to see you in the next one bye